Tonight, we are hearing from Meridian leaders and residents about a proposed tax increase. Twin States reporter Emily Erickson tells us why some city leaders are against making homeowners shell out more cash. If we reduce spending, I will be in favor of a tax increase. But right now, I just can't support it. With the continued waste and abuse that's going on in our local government, that it's like a slap in the face to the voters to raise their taxes at this time. While the mayor and a few others are in favor of a tax increase, some on the city council are against it. Our constituents who I talk to in my ward, they really concerned about the tax increase. And again, if my constituents in my ward do not want it, I'm going to go with what my constituents are saying. Revenues have been stagnant, but our expenses are going up. And so we've got to control our costs, eliminate the waste, and hopefully come with a balanced budget that's not going to require a tax increase. And I think that we can do that, but it's going to take some hard decisions um, on the part of the council to decide what to cut. And then it's going to take responsibility on behalf of the administration to actually manage the money properly. Councilwoman Kim Houston says spending is a major issue within the city and that a tax increase is not appropriate at this time. If we cut spending, maybe next year, we can maybe look at a tax increase because what I'm hearing from the people I, 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 I serve is that why should we have a tax increase when we haven't got spending under control? We'll be in the same place yet again next year, having this same conversation. Mayor Bland expresses concerns about overall costs and says we have not had a tax increase since 2008 and that with the rise in cost in living, this tax increase is needed. I'm sure that if I look over these costs that I have here, housing has gone up 18 percent. Daycare has gone up 45 percent. Four-year college tuition has gone up 45.6 percent. This tax increase is to be voted on within the next two weeks. Reporting at City Hall, Emily Erickson, Twin States News. All right, so what is this proposal? A 2.46 millage increase. It would mean an additional $36 per $100,000 in home value or $24.60 for those with a homestead exemption, again, per $100,000. Now, city leaders say that would bring in about $850,000 in additional revenue. The tax increase slated for a vote within the next two weeks.